Hello there, uh, cheeky little stop for me. I uh, stopped for a nice cup of coffee, a um, bit of dirty food, and yeah, on my way to Hawcott. We have a social this weekend, team social. So there's gonna be plenty of footage. I uh, hope you enjoy it. So we have arrived at Hawcott. I am getting pestered by a wasp. We've arrived at Hawcott and me and Keith have got down a day early because we're doing some product bits. And then tomorrow we've got the big CC Moore social. So we're really looking forward to that. Um, as I say, we're, we're just shooting some little bits and pieces. Hi Keith. Hello. And um, yeah, and then we're gonna get the rods out tonight a day early and we're gonna stitch Gricey up because we need some spotting shots. No, so we're gonna spot all well, of his bait. Also all because he deserves it. That is true. So we're, hey, yeah. Going on yeah, down we'll, there. Sc we'll scare them off who's going in. Yeah, that's it. Um, but yeah, we need some spotting shots, so we're gonna put Gricey in a sp swim and then spot the hell out of it today. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not gonna. But um, yeah, it should yeah, be a good weekend. <laughs> okay. And um, yeah, there's gonna be loads of updates throughout it. Hopefully, we can catch some of these Hawcott scalies. Here's one of the things we're filming. Pacific tuna based spod mix with the Fish Frenzy XP instant spod mix, some salt and some tuna boilies. Fish this two different ways, you could have it sloppy for spodding over zigs, or you could also have it a bit stodgier for fishing on the deck. What do you reckon? Personally, stodgy on the deck. Oh yeah, stodgy right. on but, the dance floor. I don't fish zigs very much so. There we go. Right, so Brad's just found a nice little spot out there. And he hasn't wrapped it up yet, so we're going to have a little competition between the two of us. What's the bet? What are we, we wagering? Um, cup of tea. Cup of tea? Cup of tea. Yeah, alright. Yeah, okay, we're going to wager a cup of tea. Whoever's closest doesn't make the tea. It's the right way around, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so he's going to cast it out, and we're going to have a guess, see how, see how far it is. Have I got to cast first, and then we guess? Yeah, yeah, because I want to see how far it's going. Right, okay. Otherwise, you've got a clear advantage, otherwise. Right, okay, you ready? Yeah. I think I, that I, is 16 15, and three quarters. 15 wraps. Yeah? I'm saying 15. Spot on 15. Okay. Now Actually, we... I think it's more like 16 and a half. Okay. Right, let's let's wrap see. It up. Let's wrap it up. You ready? Yeah. Yeah. Nope. yeah. 25. <laughs> 26. Right. One, two, three. <laughs> Oh, come on! Get a cat on, boy! <laughs> What's going on, Brad? Well, look at this! There you go. Thank you very much. Lovely. I lost. <laughs> and I've even treated you to good coffee. Good coffee, and then I gave you milk, didn't I, to go in it? Yeah, who has UHT milk? Like, honestly. So, I'm just about to put some bait in. I thought, why not put a bit of bait in before everyone else turns out, get my spot rocking, and then I can just bang three singles out on it. And I just thought I'd run you through what I'm using. Uh, yesterday, as you can see in here, I prepped a load of bait. So in there, I've got crushed pro stim liver, 10 mil pro stim liver, some chops, and some whole 15 millers as well. And all of that's been glazed in the pro stim liver liquid. So that's had 24 hours to sort of like really soak into the bait and uh, give me leakage for a lot longer. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add some of that to a bucket. I'm probably gonna put out a five litre bucket to start. So we'll have a couple of good scoops of that. Maybe one more. And then in here, we have got some different size pellets. So we've got the Halibut Ultra Mix in there and some six mil tuna pellets. So good health for the pellet. More. And then for your typical day ticket scene, everyone uses it. The fish are used to eating it and it gives you a bit of visual attraction. We've got some corn. So I'm gonna bang some of that into the mix as well. And that is as simple as it gets really. 
The only thing is, my corn's still a little bit frozen. So I'm probably going to leave it for 20 minutes so it defrosts so it doesn't um, float away and all the seagulls eat it. Yeah, quite honest. a bit in there as well. Yeah, quite yeah, so a bit. So it's not just a fleck of colour, is it? You actually. Well, once it's all mixed in, if I don't get it all over the floor, there'll be bits and pieces, but it also gives me like an option of different hook baits as well. Like I can fish a little 12 mil yellow northern over that. I can fish match the hatch hook baits to go with the pro stim liver. I can fish pellet wafter hook baits. Like I've got loads of different hook bait options in there. Yeah. So as you can see, loads of different colors, loads of different size food items and lots of, lots of attraction. So yeah, I think to begin good. with, I'm gonna solid bag one up and two on little pop-up bricks, I think. Well, I do. But we've got work to do first. Yeah, we have. Yeah. This but, is the coffee break. Yeah, this is the coffee break. He hasn't even had a cast yet and he's wrapping up to a spot. Feeling. A feeling. Not a little insight from Lee, no? <laughs> no, Lee didn't know that. How many wraps? What are you aiming at? What rig are you using? I'm aiming at the water. How many sugars do you have in a brew? Um, none. Okay, okay. He's sheeping me up, Lee. He's gone next door already. Whole lake's free and he's gone next to me. You've gone, you're, you're fishing how many wraps and then like 40 yards past you, so I'm just going to cast. Great. Cast over there and cut them off. Cheers for that. Let's see it. Let's see if the spot yeah, pays yeah, off. Fishing for them, I am. Okay, okay, I see. <laughs> so one of the rules at Hawkeye is you've got to dip your nets, slings, and mats before you start. So got nets and that at the ready. You gonna open it up? Yeah, yours look a bit dry, mate. Yeah, all right. What's that? Um, I've caught carp since end of <laughs> April. <laughs> But I am fishing for like nine fish at the minute. What's Grice's excuse? <laughs> he ain't that many. There we go. Bang it all in. Lovely. In there, like Get it all in. Get it all in. Get a good old wash off. Yep. Two nets there, Brad. Two? You are feeling confident. confident mate. Did you say you're only fishing two rods as well? Confident, yep. One fish per rod. Oh, yeah? Yep. Double take business. <laughs> there we go. All done. Feeding time Mozzie at the zoo. <laughs> Brad's on the mozzie dippers. Should we, should we see if we get a cheese pole? <laughs> a what? A cheese pole. Ah, oh, it's dead. Keith, he's homeless. He hasn't got a chair. <laughs> The only healthy thing here is Flynn. <laughs> <laughs> Michael in the moon. <laughs> Michael in the moon. <laughs> who's going to be? Who's going to be the first to catch? Out of us. Us? Yeah. We're Maybe. probably all blank, to be honest. Yeah. Oh, really Probably. confident there, mate. Not me, so I don't have a line in the lake yet. <laughs> right, Brad's off for Mark. A rod as well. <laughs> oh god, somebody wipe me of a rod in. <laughs> Brad's off for Mark. You wipe me of a rod in? Is it weeded you up? <laughs> the rod has weeded me up. <laughs> Look at it fitting out there. It might be a carp. It's not a carp. Honestly, it was like this. Hey, if this is a rud, you'll be the first person in history to be weeded up by a rud. Uh, it's caught on the other line. Can somebody wind that other rod in? All right, Brad's about to land his first right, fish of the go. trip. Hold on, I need me net. Get it. Yeah, yeah. Oh! oh. Mate, we got to get that out. Look at the size of that. Look at it, it's like a car. That's a monster. <laughs> Look at the size. Did you drop the lead? Yeah, it did. Yeah, that was, wow. Look at that. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Look at that hook hold. Plum in the middle of the bottom lip, <laughs> right where you want them. What have you got to say about your new PV? Um, I'm going to enter the Drennan Cup with this one. I think it's a clear winner. What was it on? 
<laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it dropped the lead and everything. What are you filming me for? I'm filming your cast. Uh, no pressure. I want to see it first time on the spot. Well, it's going to be second time because I've just had a car. Okay, second time. Here he goes. Oh. Yeah? Oh. 18. Yeah, keep that. Brad's the swim manager for the weekend. 19. Get rid of that. What's going on here? So basically, we've got... We've worked out about 27 people, roughly. Um, and obviously, we want to give everyone a reasonable bit, reasonable bit of space and plenty of water to go at. So we're just eliminating a few swims off of here just to make sure people aren't going to be hemmed in and um, leave a few swims as well spare. So... If they do get a dud draw and they don't fancy it in there after a night, they can have a little move, so. Sweet. There we go. Yeah. 39. 39. Sounds uh, like we're doing like no, bingo or get something. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Keith's bingo. Two fat ladies. You ever thought about going to bingo, Keith? <laughs> is, not that, is, I'm not is that, that ageist? Oh, sorry, mate. Is that age, sorry. such an ageist? <laughs> it was my weight this morning and now it's me age. Well, bullying at work, guys. <laughs> bullying in the workplace. Thirty-three. Yeah. Here he is. Here he is. The number man. Here he is. Right, who wants to go first then? Go on, man. I'll volunteer. There you go. Right, look away. They only pick one piece of paper. I've only got one bit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What you got? Thirty-five. Where's that? Thirty-five. That'll be along that bank there. What are you in? 36. That's a good one, though, 36. 10? 10. 10. Long one, 36. 10. Yep. Slap bang in the bay. That one over there. That's a good shot. That's like... Is that where all them fish are? Yeah. Oh, oh pressure's 38. on. 38. 38. 38. Whatever that is. Okay. okay. 38, that's on the tank, mate. Okay. Right. Yeah. Right. 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 On yeah. the beer, aren't you, mate? Yeah, definitely. Dave's, Dave's supplying the goods. <laughs> Got to start with social in the right way, aren't you? Yeah, you do. Where are we, Brad? In my swim. No. Tell us, <laughs> guys, where, where are we at? They know where we're at. We've done about 19 bits to camera. No, we haven't. We haven't we're, 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 you trotting, haven't. we're trotting for Rudd. Trotting for rudd? Yeah, 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 do a pan round and look at all the fish in front of me. Can't pan it. species, like. Yeah. Rudd. I see you see more social, 2023. What's going down? <laughs> Big box, little box. <laughs> Big box, little box. Huh? So the sun is shining. Everybody has turned up now, drew their swims, and I think everyone's happy. What do you reckon? Eh? I reckon pretty happy, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, happy. yeah, yeah. Happy. Are you happy, Leon? Yeah, happy. I'm always happy. Yeah. Happy, I'm just happy here for the be, social, yeah. <laughs> just here to see what gets caught, have a good time. Yeah. And, oh. Um, that was a big rud. Big rud. Big rud. One, one. <laughs> so yeah, every, everyone's barring around, having a look at their swims now, and I think they're going to get set up for the day ahead. So nice yeah. warm one. Why don't we get some clothes out? Yeah. Warm. Go around and have a look, see how people are getting on shortly. Yeah. We'll report back in a bit, eh? Yeah. What's in your bait? It is a mix of tuna, yeah, frozen liver, oh yeah, nice, frozen bloodworm, frozen water snails, yeah. corn, bloodworm pellet, ultra mix pellet. Looks pretty good now. <laughs> Just having a wander around the lake. Um, everyone's getting their rods out and finding their spots. Just wanted to walk around and check that everyone's happy and 
um, happy in their swims and you know no complaints so uh, yeah I think uh, I think the next person I'm coming up to is Harry actually Harry Hogan so we'll have a see maybe Put your trousers back on. <laughs> Here he is, the Hulk's the Hogan. Yeah. How's it going, mate? How many have you had? Nothing yet. Yeah, you got the rods out. Yeah, what's up with you? Waiting, waiting to have a few beers, aren't I? All right. <laughs> You're doing that first, are you? Yeah. 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 There he is. Yeah. Come on, then. Get these rods out. Put baits on them first. What baits are you putting on them? What's this? What's this going on here? Oh, I can't show you that. What is it? Not the leak. Is it not? Prototype. Is it actually? Yeah. Prototype what? I can't tell you. Yeah, see the secret from you, Anne. Is it, is it genuinely secret? Yeah. No, it's not. It's a prototype. Is it? But it's 12 mil. Are we releasing them or not? Uh, we're just playing around with it at the moment. So. Yeah. Maybe in the future? Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Be good. We'll see. Well, this is what you shouldn't do, right? You shouldn't leave your rods unattended if you're gricey. Otherwise, things happen. Jim, huh? you can't mix it with orange. <laughs> Could be any further away. You've got to drink it neat, mate. Yeah. Ow. Action. Right, everyone. CC Moore, Beer Pong Championships 2023. Get it on in. We'll play eight teams, three in a team, we'll put the teams together. And the prize for this is something incredible. Moro's pulled it out of his pocket and we've got five medals to give away. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> so, team one, first up is the man himself, Ian, Michael Brown, and Mick. Right, give them a round of applause. <laughs> uh, they're playing Keith, Kai, and Harry Hogan. Woo! <laughs> Sound enthusiastic, everyone. <laughs> Come on. Come on. What are you doing? You're poaching. You're poaching. You're poaching. Little poach up. We're all getting drunk. <laughs> So we have came to the final of the Beer Pong Championship CC Moore Winners Cup medals 2023. Can I hit some noise? Woo! Woo! Yeah, they look interested. This is where things. Give us a, give us a. Yeah, I like it. Pan back round, and this is where things get interesting. Ah, uh, what's going on here? We're going away. It's really hot. <laughs> We've got Going hot away from the beer now. Now we're mixing it up. <laughs> right, I reckon we have two Jaegers on each side. Two Jaegers. <laughs> get them out, get them out, get the Jaegers out. That's got loads of dog bits in there. <laughs> <laughs> 
Alex, you're in the final, mate. With Leon. Right, we'll have two Jaegers. Yep. We'll have two Proseccos. Yeah, nice. Have... Can you watch where that cork's going, Machi? I don't like it, they do that on oh. film. Aaron's on Prosecco duty here. Yeah. And then we'll have the rest of Lager like normal. How many things are we doing? Right, now pop it out, pop it out. We're going for a... We're going for a fake? But, no, no. <laughs> Yeah, come on. We're going for a full. Ready? Not like. Send it. You yeah. Send ready? It. Yeah. Come on, then. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, you're in the final, Liam. You went to see the drink. Pricey secret serum. Ready? The rings are, guys. <laughs> We've got nine cups. Nine. We haven't. <laughs> Six and six. It's not, How it's many 12. Have we got twelve cups here, <laughs> Ooh, and we're hey Leon, shut up, listen. <laughs> oh, we're competing yeah. for the title of the beer pong championships from CC War 2023. It's never been done before. You can show all your subscribers, mate. <laughs> Have a word with him. Stop, stop drink, giving him drink, someone for God's sake. <laughs> Game on. Round one. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, wait. oh he's blocked it. Yeah. Oh! We have got. We have got Jaeger Meister. Oh, <laughs> what is that? Jaeger. Oh, no. I don't like it. We like to drink with Leon, because Leon is a. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? Did that just rip? <laughs> it's the same size. Good size, isn't it, for you? Nice dress. I reckon I can put that on. <laughs> so, good morning. Um, first morning, so the Saturday morning. Everyone arrived yesterday. We all obviously had a bit of a, too much of a good time last night. But, uh, yeah, there's been a few messages pinging about, so my way around just to see what people have got get some photos put the waders in case I'm out of breath already so early start five o'clock I could see the first one being played and someone else was in and another bit message pinged in as well so the lake suddenly kicked off which is good some bites being had and uh, yeah so let's see what people have got Right, so I've made it round to Alan's swim. And we got one just down here, look. See if I can lift that up. Let's give you a better look. There we go, look at that. It's common. So here we've got Alan. Now Alan's had the first blood. Lovely common of 19 and a half. Well done, mate. Ooh, he's lively. Oh, I kind of wanted that to slap you in the face, but... <laughs> well done, mate. What do you have that on? Uh, just a prostim liver dumbbell wafter. Nice. Little mesh bag. Short he's range. lovely. Well done, mate. Thank you. Awesome. So we're here with Alex, and he's just had a 32.4. Our, our estimates were a bit low. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, lovely fish, mate. So here it is, 32.4 for Alex. I believe this might be the second fish that someone's had. Um, what do you have on, Alex? Uh, live system wafter, over two kilos of live system and hemp and maize. Lovely, look at that.
Right, so made it round to Harry now. Yeah. And, oh, that sun's bright. Harry's had one. I reckon, how big do you reckon, Harry? Low 20. Low 20? Yeah. Right. Lovely little corner there. Mmm. Liner, mate. I've still got fish on him. Looking for the shape in the mat, looks about 18, maybe. Yeah. Mm, 17, 18. Yeah. Damn, he's lovely. He is, isn't he? Well done, Harry. Thank you. Look at that mouth. Yeah, so we've got a lovely lean here for Harry. Well done, Harry. Yeah, what do you, you have that on, mate? Crazy liver water. Nice. Yeah, over a load of freebies. Load of freebies? Just mm. loose boily? Yeah, and a bit of particle in there as well. Lovely, look at that. Lovely one. He's a, he's a pretty one, that one. Yeah, it is. Well done, mate. Oh, social media buzz. Well done, Harry. Well done, mate. Lovely. So now with Dave, another lovely linear. Really nice, Two man. lovely ones we've seen this morning. Two lovely linears. Right. Well done, Dave. Beautiful. Right, here we are with Dave. Well done, Dave. Look at that. What a lovely linear that is. Live system doing the business. Live system. Look at that. Gorgeous. Well, Dave, let's get some snaps. Look at this side. Look at that. Beautiful. That is gorgeous. Mega one, Dave. Yeah, nice one. Well done. Good morning. <laughs> nice morning wake up. <laughs> Well done, mate. Lovely, well done, mate. Look at that. Lovely, Dave. Thank you. Hey. What's happening, brothers? What's going on? Well, woke up this morning and... I thought he was gone. You were gone, <laughs> photo duties. <laughs> and uh, basically I'm fishing three bowstring tight lines out to the spot. And all the bobbins have dropped down by about two inches from where I've been picked up by the rud in the night. So... It's a bit of a reset. Spot. I'd have a little reset, a little top up of some fresh bay. The weather's looking prime for it now. Not that I've seen anything in front of no, me. But, no, no. Um, yeah, look, it looks good for today. Like, I think a few anglers are going to definitely get amongst them today. It's evident there's loads down in that corner. Yeah. But I feel like the lads that are over on the point... I think they've got a good chance. I think today will be definitely. the day. Hopefully, hopefully. Especially, especially when I reel in. So, is that a bro? <laughs> yeah. Why do you want one? Yeah, I'll make one. You're not offering no. Well, I can offer you a brew. Well, we've got to do another competition to well, win a brew, like. Well, but then you'll end up making me one, won't you? Oh, that's <laughs> fighting talk. <laughs> What's going on then? It's raining. It's a bit pretty, bleak this morning. It's pretty grim down Hawkeye, isn't it? But it's been good so far, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, I think there's been eight fish now up to this point. Biggest 32 pounds. Biggest 32. So the old trophy's all to play for at the minute. Yeah, to be fair, it's quite a good number of fish in here over 30, so. Mm. Still all to play for, but it's quite bleak where we are, isn't it, at the minute? Down, yeah. Down in the bay. Yeah. But so, there, there's some fish like out in front of you, but longer. Yeah. Like, and then further left round you go, it's just a bit barren, to be honest. So a lot of fish up the other end. Loads up the other end. Where like Harry is and Sean and stuff. So. Yeah. Hope, so in yeah. between Sean, Gav, 
Harry, Nick and Ash, they've got massive pod of fish in front of them, so hopefully they can capitalise on it. I think they'll catch a few more to be fair down there. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I think a few of us are just recovering from last night as well. Well, you are. <laughs> Kai recovering. definitely is. <laughs> is he up yet? His, his bed chair's like all twisted and bent. He hasn't <laughs> even put his poles together on his bivvy. <laughs> Bless Brilliant. Him. That's so funny. No, it was a good crack last night, wasn't it? Good fun, mate. Good fun. Hopefully this weather clears up a bit before our barbecue later. Yeah, so. that'll be nice. Yeah, should be good. But if we get any more fish, we'll report back and let you know. What's happening? Day. What's happening? We're going to Kai swim because he's got a car. No, what's happening in your swim? Nothing's really They're good. all over you and you've not had one? Nothing. Nah, mate. You're the only one out of all the C. Seymour staff. He's what? We caught with one. carp on him and you none haven't of caught us, None of us have caught, have we? Yeah, but we don't have fish on us. I need some advice. Comment <laughs> below to tell me what rig yeah. I should use. Mm. Like, kind of, Sharp hooks would be helpful. Sharp not, hooks. Not yeah. tangled rigs when not, you cast Not tangled out. rigs, yeah. No, no, that's an edge when you tangle up. No, it's not. Because it, when no. the carp picks it up, the lid. they've got to Thanks untangle more. it. It's <laughs> yeah. really nice up there, isn't it? Hopefully one in. Big Kai giving it the big one, 112 yards. Is he happy? He's happy. Can I see the weasel organised it this weekend? And what happened? Yeah. Leon? Yes. Is a Jaffa cake a biscuit or a cake? Everything's a biscuit. Is that a biscuit? Yeah. Everything's a biscuit. Are you a fan of Jaffa's? I'm a fan of everything. Jaffa's are in the top 10. Are they? Yeah, top 10 biscuits. Why don't you do um, a Jaffa cake in the challenge for uh, Leon? Well, we've got to find a, a, a late beginning of day. Junction 12. Junction 12. Could do Junction 12, come on. Jaffa cakes. Nine letters. We'll have to catch nine fish. Nine fish at Junction nine 12. Nine letters. That is like... What's your forfeit? How many lifelines is he allowed? We can give him extra ones. And if we don't Seven? do it, if we don't do it, does that mean we have to give five kilo bait to a customer? Yeah. Bundle. Oh no, if you do, yeah. Is that nine? Nine. Nine fish? But uh, you could just do Jaffa. Jaffa, you're Jaffa, aren't you? By all accounts. <laughs> <laughs> How big, mate? 26 pound on the dock. Do. Nice. Well, tail that one. There we go. It's just safe. It's just proper tense, isn't it? <laughs> Look at that little spike. <laughs> Well done, mate. Massive pecs on it, look at that. A gorgeous little comment. What's going on here, then? You got two in there, yeah. yeah. Happy days. There you go, mate. That's a nice one. Nice little one, isn't it? Yeah. Happy days. On the pros, Tim, again, yeah? Yeah. Wafters. Brilliant, mate. Sip of that. Happy days. Let's get that big one out, yeah? Yeah. What's it saying, guys? Hey? Uh, 
just over, no, bang on 28. Last? Yeah, 28, mate. Happy days. Yeah, well done. That'll do, will it? There we go, that's a lush one, mate, isn't it? Yeah, a lovely 28 pounder on the pro stem. Probably a 30 before spawning, do you reckon? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Long old fish, isn't it? Yeah, beat me up. Love Is that just off that weed bed, yeah? Yeah, off the weed bed, mate. Had a few off that this morning, so... What's that, fish, fish number three? Happy days, yeah, fish number three. Hopefully a few more to come. Yeah, quality, mate. Okay. I don't think it'll be your last. There's a lot of fish out there, isn't there? Yeah, there's a few million about. Bang on those. Perfect, isn't it, by that weed? Yeah, it looks bang on. Mm. What's going on down here, then, mate? Uh, Make you on video, by the way. Oh, right. <laughs> What's going on down here? A lot, mate, really. Just uh, having a little bit of a leather bolt. What, finding a new spot? Yeah, just... I think on that spot... I had a run on that spot last night and I thought if anyone was going to go, that it was going to be that one. And that's the one that went? No, it won't. Oh. So, um, just having a little bit of a play bolt just to see if I've got that spot right, really. I'm thinking of maybe just coming across a little bit. Just going a little bit shorter. The, the fish that I had was sort of from down here, real close. In. I'd seen some fizzing last night. Yeah. When I got back, I wasn't even going to put that rod out. And um, I'd seen some fizzing just down here, really short. But I'm just double checking that I got that spot right last night. I'm thinking maybe I'll just get the throwing stick out again, but just maybe come a little bit further and a little bit shorter. What's that spot like? Like Rock clean? Hard. Rock hard, yeah. yeah. It, it's clean. The advantage of coming in down here is like, as soon as you can, you can see where the gaps in the weed are. Yeah, yeah. It's quite, uh, and there's some quite big patches and I just, that are clear. I just think it's maybe finding like, I don't really like to use the term spot within a spot, but yeah, yeah. I think that maybe there's sort of like, just where you'd get it a little bit right, but didn't really see a lot when we come back down here last night. Again, it was just like a little bit opportunist really. I'd seen that fizzing and just put a little stick on it with a rig. Did you bait much on that spot you caught off? No, just literally a golf ball sized bag of um, crumbed up pro stem liver and yeah. just a little dumbbell wafter rod at the top of it. Oh, nice. And, uh, yeah, like, like, like literally really short range. Not under the rod tips, it's like six and a half wraps out that way. You can sort of see where the weed arcs round in here. Yeah, yeah. Just where them sort of like rudd and stuff like that are fizzing up a little bit now. It was just literally in there. Oh. Like I said, that spot over there just looked right for it. You've got it right in that bay. You've got the um, like the cove in the tree line, and it just looked really good, but nothing. Has Dave got one? Yeah. Right. Better go and see what he's got. Specimen rud. <laughs> Big old rud. Lovely fish, isn't it? Bait and a bit of um, glasses to add him into it as well. Oh, did you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Bit of a combo. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Get that rod back out, mate. Right, mate, what's going on? Right, so just gonna have a look at the rig that I had that fish on this morning. Um, the spot I'd found that layers clears, but it's a little bit silty, so I've lengthened it a little bit, but it's literally just a simple slip D. And then on the end of that, I've just got one of the new Pro Stim Liver uh, 10 by 15 dumbbell wafters. And all I'm doing there is just to add a little bit of extra attraction around it. I've just got like a golf ball size mesh bag with some uh, crumbed hole and half baits in. Just literally attach that off to the hook and then cast it out. So what, you leave a tag end on it, do you? Yep, leave a tag end out and then all that allows me to do is I can wrap it round the back of the shank yep. and then it just traps the D in place and it just makes sure that I don't get any tangles or any movement in the D. Ah, oh, perfect. Hopefully you have another one. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Have you glued these wafters up? Just, yeah, I got them last night. Um, Keith brought my bit order through. 
I got them last night and then just um, put a bit of glue on them last night. Just real light glaze, just so they go tacky real quick. Left them out in the sun yesterday. They look nice, don't they? Yeah, they do. What do you think to a new bait? It's really good. It's yeah. nice. Yeah. Bottom baits are nice and soft, so they'll come up real easy. You can do them in your hand. Hmm. And then, uh, but yeah. Seems Confident really using it? Yeah, first time out that I used it, I'd had a fish within 15 minutes. That's always a good start, isn't it? Yeah, it is, so, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, probably accompanying baits seem to be really good with it. The wafters seem real good. Um, yeah. Plenty of fish caught on this trip around the lake. Yeah, on it. it seems to be doing pretty well. I think that every, pretty much everybody Everyone, that's here is, yeah. is using it. And it's done some good ones as well. Nice. Report back if we get any more. Fish. <laughs> oh, that's a different type of lead, Bradley. Can't get it through the owl. Hmm. Time for a change of tactics. What's the change going to be? Go a bit longer and hope for the best. Go long or go home? Yeah, so most of the fish are sat out in the middle and down to the right. But... Yeah, on that far side over there. Yeah, no, you're not feeling them. No. So what are you doing so, then? I'm going to have a little change up. The rod have been mullering me, so go a bit longer and um, see what happens really. But I've just had a little lead around out there. It feels nice with a bare lead. So I've just put on a grappling lead. Just have a little feel around and see if there is anything that my bare lead's missing. See, it goes down nice. Yeah, that's got to be all right, isn't it? Yeah, and then it like hits weed there. That's fine. So it's nice and smooth. Which will be sweet to present some pop-ups over, I think. Mm. What do you reckon, Leon? I'm going to stick and bore them out. I'm going to try and bore them out. Just like rigs and bait and spots. And... <laughs> it normally works for me, boring them out. I got pretty rough. What have you got on your head? This is what they call a hat. <laughs> <laughs> this is a hat. So, you know, you have, the problem is, if you had a hat on, you'd get half a lot of hair coming off of it, like that. You it's going for the full camo look here. Full camo look, definitely. You've even got camo pants on, haven't you? I have. We fox, see, fox we, camo pants. We seen him earlier. Even when he's nearly naked, the carp can't fit in. No, come on. Little tappy tappy there. So, it's big nice. dip in the trees, ground yeah. it, move slightly right into the silt. Three rods on it? Three rods on it, yeah. You're gonna be able to bait that far? It's only what? 90. 19 reps, probably. Worth a, worth a change, isn't it? Yeah, if it's not happening, mix it up a bit, you know? Make the changes. To be fair, like, if we were fishing for ourselves, like, we would have moved, let's be honest, but... Yeah. Where would you have moved to? We are on party point right now. Well, if, if everyone was still here, but I had the option to move, I'd probably go down in that far corner. Would you, yeah. Because both mornings there's been fish showing along that far side. And uh, Alex, who's fishing sort of like the entrance to that bay, he had a 32 this morning, so... Do you reckon you've just pulled that in off the back of your spot? Off well, the back this, of my this spot? This side of the spot. Yeah, there's loads of uh, weed out there just under the surface, about 30 yards out. Hmm. So. Get your rod sorted. Spot it up, get the rod sorted. New lease of life. Barbecue. It's got to be barbecue time soon, isn't it? Barbecue. <laughs> What's your favourite barbecue food? Mine? Yeah. It's got to be chicken. Why it? did you pan No, it's not. It's got to be chicken. It's definitely not. No, chicken. It's sausage. Barbecue chicken. Mate, you love the chicken. sausage. Love you told chicken. me you love no, sausage. Chicken. Chicken. This is a nice one, that. Isn't it? It's really, it's no, not, it's a real nice one. Like, really well proportioned. Yeah, it? it is. And the scales are cool on it, like that. Yeah. It's got a good mouth on it. And... Yeah. Sick. Here we go. Here we go. How big is this one? Twenty-five and a half. Yeah, lovely old carp, isn't it? Still there. Yeah. Yeah. Nicely done, mate. Very nice. What's that number? Number five. Yeah. Let's get her back, yeah? Yeah, let's get her back. Beauty. Beautiful. Well done, mate. Nice. 
Salud. Lush. Happy days. <laughs> I knew that was that, I can hear them. Boy. <laughs> Give me a buttering tutorial. Right, the key to getting even butter is a nice what? spread. Leave your butter out in the sun all day, it goes like milk. <laughs> Number two, you've got to have a nice flat surface to work on. See that? Nice and even. Take your bun, you get your butter there, you spread it like this. Yeah. All right. It's a bit like laying bricks. You got to go right to the edge. You're bricky. Yeah, mate. And then this is a trick. They were like, "Why don't you put both sides of the bread?" But there's no point. You've just got to go thick. You got to go over. You got to mush. You got to move. Done. Crisis battering tip of the week. what you want to see in the mornings well half of it is <laughs> three days too late <laughs> it's solid in the way <laughs> isn't it that's not there, is it? Um, I don't know right in through the weeds no. I can't see you look tired mate I've got that much Gunk in my eyes. Well, you got an audience here. You've got the boss, the Duke, and the Kefus, and Flynn. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what, though. Tell you what. Yeah. Change oh. yesterday. Change of spots. Going out a little bit further to the edge of my boundary. And we've had a bite. Do you reckon it's a tent? Um, spotting was uh, a bit more um, accurate than somebody else's. Minus. I think I think you need to go to the gym first. <laughs> you need to get a body, not a 12 year old out. body. Right, Give it some like your life depends on it. That's never reached. That might reach, it's nowhere near. It's about 30 yards to the right. <laughs> he's hit the clip. <laughs> Give him his chew, right? he's hit the clip at 25 rounds. Um, Kevs. <laughs> I think I think I managed to get one on the spot out there. One spot. Yeah, just just the one. There's what one more than um somebody else down the bank. Ian. <laughs> no, not that far down the bank. <laughs> Where's it going? Face of concentration. Not She's stuck in the weed. There's a lot of weed out there. Right there. That's all right there. It's all going off this morning. There's a show between me and Brad this morning. Oh no. One time of that, would it? What? What's going on, Keith? Go on! <laughs> Picking up the other line. How is it? Yeah. You're off, mate. I'm off now. I've got to go. Seven o'clock in the morning. Have you enjoyed Knackered. it? You kept me up. You're snoring all night. 
Yeah, good one. Any noises? So, yeah, it's been really, really good. Really enjoyed it. Had a good fun time. Didn't catch anything, but it didn't really matter. It's mad, does it? Just drank mean. lots, ate lots. Yeah. Just had lots of fun and talked lots of rubbish. Good to see you. Good to see the guys. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. So, enjoyed it. Off now. See you on the next Biscuit Bonanza. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. right. See you in a bit, mate. A bit of CC more teamwork going on here. Taking both my lines out. Probably dragged that one in the weed in. Hi. He probably dragged that one into the weed. I think Flynn's on netting duty here. I'm alright, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Flynn. No, we're right. Another common. Is it? There's not going to be many in here, is there? Salmon skew. Really lovely. Happy days. Come on, keep us. Yeah, 30 pounder, I think. Right, ready? Moment of truth. Ready, 31.5. Oh. oh, did I say between 31 and 32? Oh, did I? Car, you're bouncing a bit. What is that? 31 on the nose. 31 on the nose. <clears throat> nice keep. Well done, Dave. Good, mate. But you haven't won the trophy. Oh. Unreal. Should have bounced it a bit more. It's going to be a last ditch effort. Well done, mate. Nice yeah. one, though. Yeah. Nice little reward. Very nice. How many spots do you fish? That's your third different That's my one. Third spot, yeah. There you go. Effort equals reward. Yeah. Flip. Flip. Oh. Help. Oh, Fox there. impact spot versus yeah. Flynn. Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's own little ecosystem down my trousers. <laughs> <laughs>
that is the way to end the social. How big, Keith? 31 on the nose. Lovely old yeah. common. Yeah, we've had a great time down here at Hawcott Lakes and um, yeah, all the anglers really enjoyed it seeing everyone, so yeah, nice, nice way to sign off. Nice way well to done, sign Keith. off, yeah. Good skills. Yeah, well done, mate. Up, mate. Well done. Cheers. Brilliant fish. Yeah, he's lovely. See you on the next one. See you on the next one. <laughs> We lost one close in and another one's gone. Never over till it's over, is it, Brad? It's easy when they're on, yeah? I'll see him back down. Well, we thought Keith's was the last one, but left the rods out for that little bit longer. And this lovely common is definitely gonna be the last one of the trip. I think everyone's enjoyed the social. It's been a great time, a great giggle, and we're looking forward to the next one. And another plasterboard table. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mention the table. <laughs> so let's get out of here. Hey, hey. boys. I don't know what the audio is going to be like. Do you want to do like a tester? Just to see like if you've got any or if it's actually all right or not. How's it go? <laughs> oh, are we going? Yeah, what do you want? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> Kev, can you just do it for me? Too easy. If I was him, I'd put a spot on watch on it. Open again. <laughs> <laughs> Junction 12 would be good, actually. Yeah. We'll fish that, that'd be a nice one. I reckon we could catch five out of there in a week's session. <laughs> <laughs> Don't peek your nose on camera. Oh no. Jim's into his first of the session. Bring him. Nice. Look at that. I'm happy with that. Mate, it was worth a trip down to Cotswolds, wasn't it? Yeah, worth the two hour journey. <laughs> <laughs> Where is it? <laughs> Brad. Oh, I can't see. I've got What's going on? Oh, this is rubbish. Leon, for f sake! What? Oh my what? god! What? Don't want to see that. Okay, you can go. There you go. No, you go. Okay. No, Are you, you filming? Go. I am you filming. Go. Great. I just want to run it back. What's going? On. What happened, Gracie? This was my decorating table from home. <laughs> it, it wasn't yours. <laughs> it was my wife's. It was Jebus. <laughs> so I ended up getting very drunk. What? I'll put it for an expenses next week. <laughs> <laughs>